Guys, coming off last week's comeback victory, the short week of preparation for this week's game, and the uncertainty surrounding the health of head coach Mike Smith, the Falcons did exactly what they were supposed to do, come out and put away the Jacksonville Jaguars early and decisively. You know, we talked about, you know, the way we played in the second half of last week against Carolina, wanting to kind of extend that into this week and carry that over. And I don't think we missed a beat. You know, I think we came out and we, we were very uh, efficient on the first drive. Uh, Mike Malarkey did a great job of, of having some different looks for Jacksonville to go against. And um, we didn't look back from there. So that's exactly what we needed. Uh, now we just got to build on it. We got to do it week in and week out. But I'm definitely proud of we, the way we came out, started fast, stayed fast, and ended fast. I mean, it was, it was just a good, good victory for us. I just felt like. You know, during the second half of last week, and you know, this week we just been more consistent. You know, we went out there and executed, and uh, it helps to go out there and score a touchdown on the first drive. You know, get your confidence going, and you know, from that point on, we was rolling. I feel like we took the momentum from the second half of our last game, and, and we took it into this one, and it helped us out. And then our D line was firing. You know, Abe was all around. I mean, all the guys made plays tonight, and you know, good coverage on the back end, so it definitely helps. Um, but we just talked about it in the locker room before the game started. Guys, let's start fast. You know, we didn't start fast on Sunday. You know. We, we ended up playing well in the second half, but we didn't get a fast start. So I think um, the, lesson, the lesson for that was, guys, we can dominate a football game, but let's dominate it from start to finish. Let's start fast. Let's jump on these guys early. And let's make sure this game, let, let's not give them a chance. And that's what we did today. Um, and, you know, it was a great feeling, man. You know, we came out and got a good win. And, you know, I think we focused enough to know that we, what we got to do is, um, you know, try to win, you know, and try to uh, finish out you know, on a good note because we got two games left. And if we want to be a playoff team, we got to win. The Falcons have dominated their last six quarters, outscoring their opponents 65 to 14. Now they have an opportunity to sit back and let some of those bumps and bruises heal as they ready themselves for the Saints down in New Orleans the Monday after Christmas. Reporting from the Georgia Dome for CSS, I'm Zaid Hakeem.